Hey, I'm Bob the Veil Guy, and I have the pleasure of being out in Lancaster, Pennsylvania at a big uh, convention for uh, 12 Volt, and I'm pleased to be here with Paul from Unit, and he is the head of product development for uh, scanners and CB radios, which is a really big side to unit a lot of you guys obviously know with the radar detectors the r1 and r3 which are just knocking it out of the park but unit really has a very steep history in scanner cb uh, technology and right now we're looking at two of the latest products that unit is offering this is a uh, and i'm going to let paul talk about this but this is a little portable hit you know all your controls of the cb are in the handset which is really nice very unobtrusive device right to your antenna and you're, you're good to go with that and this is actually what I find a very interesting piece I uh, used to drive with unit in what they call bear trackers which were like a dedicated scanner but could also detect transmissions of low power police vehicles so when a radar detector doesn't work or if you're in the state of Virginia or you're somewhere driving where there is no radar commercial vehicle, commercial vehicle in Pennsylvania there's a lot of local police that don't they don't even use radar they can't by law a device like this will alert you when you get into a certain proximity of a uh, police officer so it's just another thing to add in your arsenal of protection and uh, this is really a fascinating unit, and I'm going to be looking forward to what Paul has to share with us about this. So why don't we, can we start with this model Absolutely. and then go to this one? Then? So what the Bear Tracker 885 does is combine our top CB radio, the Bearcat 880, with a digital scanner and adds the uh, database that uh, we were talking about here. So it will scan fire, police, ambulance, and DOT traffic, and you'll hear the transmissions as they talk. Now those are high power signals, you can hear them from miles around. But actually transmitting from the car when they keep their radio, that's low power. You can only detect that from a mile or two away. So when they key up, and they're, if they're a mile or two away, this is going to beep and let you know. And this is legal in a commercial vehicle. So no problems with the radar laws on this. The other thing is it has the entire database of the U.S. and Canada. You do not have to program this. We update that database every month, every week. So you can always have the opportunity to go and get the latest database. It has a GPS that feeds your specific location. So it is not just randomly or taking a shotgun approach. It is very specifically scanning for channels in exactly where you are. So it's very effective. And, and if I may comment, this is a wonderful feature because I drive a lot of multi-state drives. And in the old days, I say the old days, you know, you'd have to program and change to the state or area you are. And I was always hoping one day with newer GPS technology now that's so prevalent for the system to know exactly where it is and adjust its parameters precisely. So now you can drive from Pennsylvania to Florida or anywhere and the system will just automatically adjust. And the interesting piece when uh, Paul was talking about the three, the, the fire, the police, or the CB, or there, there uh, is it? Police, fire, and Police, fire, which is the safety. The, DOT for snow plows. Okay, DOT. Then there's CB priority, and then there's no priority where you can actually be on your channel 19, like a trucker channel, right? Mm -hmm. And if something is going on in the pri uh, in the public safety, it will cut in, and you can get the best of both worlds so all this, in one unit. We really didn't talk about this. It's on, it is a CB radio, so it's got the mic. You talk on your channel 19 or whichever channel you want to talk on. And as he says, you can set the priority as far as the audio. If you're receiving CB and scanner at the same time, you can have CB prioritize so it'll blank out the scanner. You can have scanner prioritize so it'll blank out the CB. I just leave it so that you hear both of them because you can really tell the difference. Your ear can tell the difference about who's talking. Very cool. And this, this puppy retails for? $399.99. $399. So you're almost getting like three different units oh, in one piece. Our Bearcat 880 is $150 every day retail. Our least expensive digital scanner, and this is a digital, is $400 retail. Now, it doesn't have all the programmability of a dedicated scanner, right. but that's not what this is for. You're driving, right? You're not messing with the radio. You're not messing with the scanner. You are driving. It's doing everything for you. That's, that's, that's fabulous. Yeah. And it's all digital, trunk tracking, all that stuff. Digital, analog through digital. Fabulous. 
Not at all. What's the, if I may, uh, is this a four watt output? It is full CD power. Yeah, full legal, CD full legal CD power. Fabulous. Great piece. Looking forward to hopefully offering this. I think this is going to be a big winner. How long has this? How long has this been out now? About one year, right out one year. One year. Right. We're at a trade show, and by the way, just in case, I, I hope uh, his voice is coming. He's lost his voice here, so I, I applaud you for a really. This is dedication to be uh, promoting. Uh, you know, as, as I told you earlier, the women say this makes me that much closer to being a perfect man. Yes. So, no voice. That's great. Okay. I want to show you one more thing. And this, this is targeted toward uh, really the like the off roaders and the uh, the, the uh, four wheelers, but also people who don't want to permanently mount a uh, CB in their car. Yeah. So this slides into a bracket. It pops right out. It unplugs, so you can easily take it in and out of your car. All of the controls, all the displays, they're right here. So if you're out. Off-roading, you're not going to run into a stop because you're looking down at the CB right here. You have it all right here. Oh, that's fabulous. So you can take this on a boat, marine, I mean, I assume you can do that. Does this, by the way, no, I guess it doesn't have marine channels or anything. No, like this that. is strictly CB. Strictly CB, right. But, um, and if you Always asking for more, right? Sorry. If you don't like green, you can change the, there's the girlfriend color, you can change the color to whatever color you want within the seven colors that it has. So we'll put it back on. Can this take a cigarette adapter uh, that you could plug in with a cigarette it's, lighter? Yeah, it's 12 volt, uh, so you don't have to use a voltage adapter. We actually have it wired. We put a, a cigarette lighter. Plug on. Karen it's Shore bare wire. From KJ Travels. You can you go on an Onyx Plus satellite radio and you just support the serial XS booth to your prize. We're competing with the uh, announcement. Of, I hope that's. Uh, Working out okay, but uh, and this guy is retailing for oh, where are we, Scott? About 149. 149. So and that's my cameraman. <laughs> so again, I you know you guys know Uniden for their exceptional radar detectors, but really uh, this gentleman, uh, Paul, you've been with the company now 15 years. The gentleman that you don't see behind the camera, wonderful guy. He's been with the company for 30. Two years, is that right? 30 years? It'll be 34 in June. 34 years. So these guys have been around the block, and you're going to get a tremendous amount of historical knowledge built into these products. And I have to believe you're at the top of your game here with these years. Nobody else can do this because it really melts our two real strong product knowledge. You know, you just can't duplicate it. Fabulous. Well, we're looking forward to. Uh, Potentially offering this and uh, having great success with it. This is a radar buster uh, that I'm speaking for. And I want to thank you very much. It's been a real pleasure. Have a safe trip back. And uh, thank you for watching.